He sent blessings on him faithfully. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh my dear brothers and sisters here we are in the car park of the Bordi center alhamdulillah today mashallah we are preparing for the coast to coast bike ride for the sake of the people of Yemen we've been preparing for quite a long time now we've been training for the last couple of weeks and we're ready to do the 130 plus mile bike ride for our brothers and sisters in Yemen and we're in partnership with Sabarudi. It's going to be a difficult uh, journey. I'm sure you're going to follow the highs and the lows over two days of riding. On this side of me, we have the van, okay? All packed up, all ready. All we need from you guys is your love, your support. So we're just going to jump onto the van and uh, take on the road. And it's, I think the journey is about 45 hours, so. 45? 45, yeah, inshallah. Still, guys, we've been on the road since 5 o'clock. We've arrived near 12 o'clock in the night time and it's difficult, it's raining, muddy. We still haven't attempt to sleep. This is part of the journey and tomorrow we've got a seven hour bike ride. We don't know what is what is ahead of us, what we are going to face tomorrow and the day after. But Alhamdulillah, it's a challenge well taken. That's why I'm doing this cycling ride. So we hope you enjoy this little documentary and please keep supporting our brothers and sisters in Yemen. So we can help alleviate the pain and Poverty. With Sabah Relief, Jazakumullah Khair, Assalamu Alaikum wa Rahmatullah. So guys, SubhanAllah, we've just arrived. It's been a very difficult six hour drive. SubhanAllah, it's almost like midnight now. And we've got to be up by six o'clock to get ready pray and then head over to start the 70 miles for the tomorrow inshallah and then the rest of the journey for after the day after what, what time do you wake up we're gonna wake up at 5 30 pray uh, fajr six o'clock breakfast half past six leave from here uh, pick up the other guys at seven quarter past seven and get to the starting point at eight o'clock Here's the tent place, this is where we're going to sleep. I would say we all stayed together good. Make tea in the kitchen. So you're happy to take the tent? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, well, who's... First time, whenever I go to visit, you don't sleep, but especially if you have to wait for So we're just getting ready to set off for our day one cycle ride inshallah. About 60 miles today from Whitehaven to Gillsland. Team's geared up, excited and yeah, all ready to go. So bismillah. Alright guys, let's go. Guys, as you can see, the brothers are all here. Just come out of the hostel now. The brothers are doing the last minute checks on the bikes. Yeah, you can see the brothers have pumped up the tires. 60, 65. Who's going to carry gas canister and a tube? You all got tubes? I've got tubes. Yeah, we're just handing out some gas canisters and we'll be rolling in about 10 minutes. So the brothers are here, ready to go. It is going to be a bit of a struggle over the next two days, but it's nothing compared to the struggle our brothers and sisters in Yemen are facing on a daily basis. We're heading towards the starting point. Obviously, we're raising money for the destitute in uh, Yemen, inshallah. So, make dua. Mate, do <laughs> And we are going to be doing a bike ride for Yemen. Everyone asks why Yemen. Yemen is the worst humanitarian crisis the world has ever seen. This is not us saying it, this is the UN telling us this. The brothers were in Yemen a few months ago and they were doing distribution of food packs, they were doing distribution of water, emergency aid, and these are the things that we've just collected for now. So we're going. Come on, come on, guys. So this is nothing for me. I wish I could have done more difficult than this to ensure that our brothers and sisters and their children in particular are very happy and comfortable. So our progeny would prevail. Inshallah, by our goodwill and what we do, if we walk the way, it's a way of life. So inshallah, this is just the beginning. Assalamu alaikum everybody, um, Hussein and Omer here at uh, Whitehaven coast to coast for the people, suffering people of Yemen. Line up, and let's get going. Okay, bismillah, alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam ala rasulillah. Guys, alhamdulillah, we made it this far. Just you guys being here. Uh, shows that uh, Allah chose you for this ride. Allah is going to reward you immensely, but you also will be tested through this ride. 
And also remember why we're doing it for. Our actions are judged by intentions. Make sure that we make our intentions for the sake of Allah and we're doing it for the poor people of Yemen. Daf, anything final few words before no, we start? All I say to you is, brother, yeah, just keep making us God while you're cycling. Yeah. All those people in Yemen, they're suffering and we're doing a ride for them, alhamdulillah. Ya Allah, Akbar. let's go. Bismillah, Bismillah. Assalamu alaikum, first checkpoint. Dangerous riders have slipped a few times, but doing charity runs, it's not easy. Please donate generously. Day one, coast to coast, cycle ride. Alhamdulillah. Trying to raise money for Yemen. We've just reached our first checkpoint and um, have to say, I'm already shattered. First checkpoint, Ahmad. How do you feel? How do you feel? Oh, great. I feel great. I feel amazing. We got there, we got here, Alhamdulillah. We're a bit slow behind the group. So, our brothers in Yemen would want to climb the biggest hill in England just to have the lifestyle we are having it here for granted. So, this is nothing for me. Uh, Zah, I've unscrewed that. Yeah. But then, see, this is a specialist pump, okay, and a specialist valve. This is specialist equipment. Hajra ran between Tafa and Marwa from the top of one to the other. Why? Because she was looking for water. And what came out, subhanAllah, the best water, Zamzam. Zam. Let me give you a tablet. And what do we strive for? <coughs> Jannah. Can you hear me? Otherwise, we're going for it, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum. It was your child, and you had to climb a mountain. You had to cycle 70 miles. You do it every day. your child water just to survive. You would do it. Come on, guys, let's go. So we, we, sh we should be treating those sons, those daughters, those brothers, those sisters like our own blood. I'll see you at the next checkpoint. Inshallah. Say that again, say that again. Yalla, yalla, Habibi, yalla. Come on, come on. I can't, bro, you're too fast. How are you? Alhamdulillah. Do you want some coffee? Yeah, yeah. Sure. The brothers are going to be coming. This place is beautiful all the way around 360 degrees. Where's the rest of them? They've just gone there. Assalamu alaikum rahmatullah. We're on the uh, first day of the coast to coast ride with 30 miles in. Brothers are going it's strong. Really, really. Uh, Alhamdulillah, I mean, we all still we're struggling, but we we get there, inshallah. Alhamdulillah. We have about four more hours left. People in duas. Assalamu alaikum and Ahmed in the back. Brothers, some of them have got injuries, health issues, but they're pushing through. So Allah give us sabr and strength. I'm trying to stay positive for the rest of the guys, but uh, mashallah, these guys are keeping up with me. It's a massive struggle, but I keep thinking the people of Yemen are in need of this. So far, so far. Yeah. I'm, I'm this year. I'm feeling a bit. I don't know why. Yeah. My legs actually are It is tough. Allah, it's very tough, I tell you. I'm about halfway through, but you know my legs are cramping up. How do you feel? Tired. But Ahmed, this is a struggle. It's a big see. struggle. But Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah. For the people of Yemen, anything. For the people of Yemen, anything. We're nearly there. Halfway point. Alhamdulillah, I'm ready. Ready to do it all in one day, inshallah. I'm done, bro. I'm all done. Ennis, you got this. How you got this, Ennis? Really, really tired. Wallahi, that's, you know, seriously, I've underestimated this ride. It's very challenging. I'm dead. Hmm? I'm dead. We'll have to end the bike. You think you can, uh, you'll make it, yeah? Yeah. I'm empty this. You got this, you got this. Next one is even harder. Charlotte will make it. Yeah. This last 10 miles is going to really take it out. It's quite uphill. SubhanAllah. Getting here was difficult. We've got a few bike issues. Gears and chains. Um, so it's just a matter of just pushing through now. Allah give us the strength of the feet. You ready for the journey, yeah? Oh, brilliant so far. So far, so good. Very tired. It's worth it. Assalamu alaikum, my dear brothers and sisters. So here we are. We've finally made it to Brampton. Alhamdulillah. This is our final checkpoint for today. Day one, coast to coast. We have approximately 10 miles left, and then we are at the hotel in Chandler. But this part of our stretch is the toughest part because we have some steep hills to climb in Chandler. We're here, bro. And that's it. Uh, I was gonna be part of the team. Fortunately, I had a bad accident. I broke my arm and dislocated my fingers. So I still come to support the team. Men are starving, bro. <laughs> That's all I'm really feeling. We're hungry. Something <laughs> double fish and shit. I'm a fantastic the, bunch the, of brothers, the, honestly. You know, right. this is what may brother, have been been brothers come together and do the right something for the deeds. This is what it's all about. Years. I'm really I'm really for it. Yeah. It's amazing. We've covered over 70 miles, and tomorrow we have about 50 miles left. Going well so far, alhamdulillah. Thank you. Cheers. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it. Thank you very much, guys. Yeah, thanks a lot. Assalamu alaikum my dear brothers and sisters, just woke up, to be honest I was exhausted yesterday. Doesn't end though, because we've got another 58 miles to go today inshallah. Gonna go for a little stroll, I'll keep you updated. Assalamu alaikum.
We thought we'd go out for a walk to touch our legs, but unfortunately, it's pouring down. Trying to get as much fuel in as possible because apparently there's a mother of all hills today. I'm not looking forward to that. It's going to be crazy. The hills are going to make. <laughs> Oh, Asalaamu Alaikum, day two. Everyone's shattered but in good spirit. Today it's gonna be difficult because it's rainy, altitude, bit of wind at the beginning, but inshallah we'll do it. Guys are all determined. Well done to everyone. So, what do we have here then? We've got uh, porridge. Brother Hashim, this 20 pound is from the Cox family which we bumped into in the car park and they asked what is this for and when I gave them the information they said we want to donate 20 pound. Masha, look at this. Alhamdulillah. Drive that heel into the ground. That's the key. Make sure that back leg stays straight and then switch. Get these, get these and that front knee. I think I might have a calf straight now, is that? <laughs> We're just about to start. As you ride, you are up the hill. You know, the strength comes from Allah. We make a card, plenty of it. Remember your brothers and sisters in Yemen. Let's go, let's go, let's go. So we just uh, arrived in Hexham on the way to Newcastle from the this is our no, uh, first no, checkpoint no, no. since there, leaving. And it's lunchtime, done the worst of it now. It's all downhill from here, so everyone should be enjoying it now. Marshall, we just completed checkpoint number three. Alhamdulillah, we've done the, the huge hill. We have approximately, what, 30 odd miles to go, inshallah. I'll tell you what, though. This was needed. Remember some relief in your duas. All the brothers that are participating and more importantly, remember the brothers and sisters in Yemen. To the left, to the left, to the left. So hi from the brothers and sisters. As you can see, we've just arrived. It's been a very challenging two and a half hours. So stay with us, help the people of Yemen. The reason why we're doing this, guys, subhanAllah, imagine a mother having to make that decision where she only has enough food for one child, yet she has three hungry faces looking at her. Keep supporting Yemen, some relief. Jazakumullah khair. We're ready to go now, guys. Okay, let's go. Where are we going? We're going to the next location, five. Let's go, Bismillah. Let's go, we're going to catch the brothers up. Sorry, I'm wasted, man. Some crazy hill today. It's been tiring, man. It's been challenging, but it's been tiring. Oh, wallahi, our struggle is nothing. I went there, I've seen it myself. So for the people of Yemen, I'll do this a hundred times over again. It's painful, man. The road, the struggle, it's hard, man. It's hard on the body. And mentally, you have to be strong. You have to keep pushing. There's a lot uphill. Allah give us sober and strength. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. How's it feeling? Uh, Muscle-wise. It's beyond breaking me, to be honest. But at the minute, my body just feels like it's breaking down. Okay, Bismillah, saddle up. I'm going. Let's go. Climbing uphill all the way through for the last 12 miles. I don't think I've experienced anything like this before. Wallahi, every time I remember the calls, I get the strength. Seriously, a message for my brothers and sisters. I mean, we're not doing this for, for fun. We're doing it for the people of Yemen. Assalamu alaikum, guys. I am immediately at several shops. We're about to make it. We're preparing our shot. As you can hear by the seagulls, the beautiful scenery, inshallah. It's going to all enjoy. What's about to happen? Jazakumullah khair, brothers. Bismillah, alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam ala rasulillah. Brothers, on uh, behalf of Sabah Relief, myself, Brother Anas, who's a trustee, really want to thank you for helping us and supporting us. We want to also extend our thanks to Masjid Taqwa, again, second year running, helping the people of Yemen. It is harder for our brothers and sisters in Yemen. They would have wanted to do this every day to look after their children. And near quitting, and they carried on and persevered. Alhamdulillah, keep supporting and donate several relief. Your money will go save lives in Yemen. Me and Brother Anas were actually in Yemen in April this year, in Ramadan. We actually saw the plight of the poor people firsthand. And really, everything that you went through today, that means so much for the poor people of Yemen. Alhamdulillah, what an epic day two journey, man. The people of Yemen are suffering. For me to do a cycle like this, this is nothing compared to that they're suffering. La ilaha illallah. So it's all worth it at the end of the day. Alhamdulillah. Assalamu alaikum, alhamdulillah. We're here. There was an amana me. He had to look after a group and lead the group. Final push, bismillah. I did it for the sake of Allah and for the people of Yemen. Alhamdulillah, there was a point that I felt so tired. But because of what I know lies ahead, so it motivated me to finish this ride. Alhamdulillah. 
alhamdulillah, you know, two days coast to coast for Yemen, struggle, and some of the hills, and some of the brothers, you know, even wanted to give up. Alhamdulillah, we have arrived. Destination. All right, boys. All done, yeah. All done, guys. Hey. Adam, good morning. Alhamdulillah. 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 It's all done. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. I like accept everyone's efforts. Beautiful. Great to finish. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. We did it. Well Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. We did it. Alhamdulillah. I like accept. Alhamdulillah. Efforts probably won't get rewarded very often, but thank you very much. Alhamdulillah, bro. My reward is Allah. Yeah. Uh, now, what would, what would they do to be in our situation? Would they cycle 130 miles to save the lives of their brothers and sisters and their children? Yes, they would. Alhamdulillah, we've done it today. 130 miles. Allah Akbar. Allah Akbar. And you can see this. See behind you. Alhamdulillah, our team. And as you can see, the brothers are here. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Okay, we've done it from you know, Whitehaven all the way down to here. 130 plus miles. Uh, we had beautiful weather, mashallah. You know, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala was on our side. Nobody had any injuries. Right. I came to witness an amazing event. You know, my, my cousin, first cousin Rasim, um, and the other riders doing a, an amazing thing for charity. Are we not grateful to Allah for facilitating our trip, making it easy? Let's do it to Allah. Alhamdulillah, I want to mention this, that we finished about half an hour ago. Had we finished half an hour later, we would have come across this type of rain. We finished just in time, and now it's starting to rain so heavy. To such an extent, we are all in this van. That's the lesson I think we should learn, that we got our pictures, we did everything, and now it begins to rain heavily. SubhanAllah. What do you say, guys? Shabir! Allahu Akbar! Shabir! Allahu Akbar! So you guys being here uh, shows that uh, Allah chose you for this ride. They were... Wallahi, every time I remember the cause, I get a strength. And also remember why we're doing it for. Our actions are judged by intentions. Make sure that we make our intentions for the sake of Allah. Inshallah, by our goodwill and what we do, if we walk the way, it's a way of life. So inshallah, this is just the beginning. We shall prevail.